everyone welcome back to this week's video so in today's video i'm going to be doing some training and getting some shillings because i need to buy the uniform for the night races team that i have got accepted into today so i hope you enjoy So I need to do the birthday race in Veildale by the cross country tracks because you get 60 shillings and 500 horse XP and I'm trying to level up Pixel here because I bought her last week. Um, so let's just do this race and then I need to earn some shillings really quickly because this outfit isn't the most expensive but it is quite expensive. Um, I just failed that race, it's quite badly. <laughs> But let's, fingers crossed I can get around this one, get my 60 shillings and head on and do some questing and some daily chores and hopefully I can get at least 500-ish shillings, um, I'm on 4,500 currently, um, so I've finished the birthday race now and I'll just get my shillings for that. So I'm just going to go up to Fairgrove Village now and so basically this is a completely new outfit with um, one of the old Pintabians which I'm thankful for so it's actually only 400 um, which is really really good for me. So it's only 400 star coins but the rest of the outfit's a bit pricey so I just need to save up a few times and that'll be absolutely fine. So I'm going to do the um, Fairgrove Stable Daily Chores because you get, I think it's 90 shillings from this that you get um, which is quite good to say that you only have to do three jobs and overall I think if you do every single stable daily chore all over your Vic I think you get 1,800 so that's quite good I'll speed up the stable chores because these are the most boring things to do in Star Stable but they do give quite a bit of shillings in the end, so they're worth it. Just extremely boring to do. And I don't know how anybody would like doing these. I went on a strike and said, that's fine. I will do every single daily chore all over your Vic for at least a week and get my shillings. <laughs> yeah, I didn't even make it one day. So let's go and get these shillings back. And then I think I'll do the When Sheep Can't Sleep. Daily quest, and then that should give me, I think it's 70 shillings for that one. Um, and then, yeah, so let's do that one. So let's accept this quest and skip through it because I don't need to read that. I mean, it's only a daily quest, so that doesn't matter too much. So let's press yes and get on with it, I'll speed this part up because it's kind of a long ride down there. So I think this is the one where you have to light the torches with the matches um, down at Andy's, which actually isn't too bad, I mean there's only a few to light. So I've finished that and I need to go back up to Fergo Village because I think there is another daily quest I need to do. I think that's where you fix the um, the penning for the sheep. So let's go ahead and do that. Again, I'll speed this part up because the daily quests are really boring. and I find them pointless, but they do give shillings and open more quests, so they're not completely pointless. So let's head back up to Fairgrove Village and get my shillings. If anybody knows any like really, really quick ways to get shillings, um please let me know. I mean, I know most of them, but I really need these shillings and I'm not spending my star coins. 
So thank you all so much for watching. I hope you like this video. Please like and subscribe and turn on post notifications. Just so you know, liking and subscribing is a free way to support me and my YouTube channel. So that would help a lot. And yeah, so I hope you carry on watching my videos. And please leave me a comment of content you'd like to see or content you'd like. To stay active with me and my channel, you can go across to my Instagram, Soraya underscore Cherry Seeds. Keep active over there. Bye.